Amy Pickerel, Communication Specialist with Galesburg District 205. Today I'm taking you inside the classroom at Lombard Middle School to Mrs. Galbraith's sixth grade science class. So today we were working on kids actually seeing and measuring density. It's something that they've heard. It's like they use it like a buzzword, but they don't really know what it means. So um, we've been kind of looking at properties of matter. We've discussed density, but to, to allow them to actually see density, we gave them a couple of um, very similar looking liquids today. We used water and glycerin. Um, they're both clear liquids that look awful lot alike, but um, when we actually measure their mass and measure their volume and kind of compare the two and actually get a, a density measurement, we can see that one, it's really, really predictable. I mean, water you can see here, no matter what the amount, it was a very like one-to-one -one ratio, very predictable. Um, we haven't graphed our, our other substances yet, but um, I think they're gonna notice that they're also very predictable. So um, just getting them to be able to see and measure that relationship and really understand what density is, not just me telling them, but rather them figuring it out for themselves. the density and even though there were the same like there's the same liquid the height and stuff it was the same it was the density was not the same but it was like filled up the same thank you mm -hmm. 